Amelia, I got some questions for you, okay? Okay. Now I gotta read my writing. <laughs> That's always the hardest part, isn't it? Favorite artist to dance to? Ooh, currently, John Bellion. Who was your first favorite artist to dance to? Uh, Pink. <laughs> Who's your favorite choreographer? Uh, Crystal Pite. Who is your favorite choreographer on So You Think You Can Dance? Mm. He came on after my season, but Al Blackstone. Who is your favorite person to dance with on the show? My favorite person to dance with on the show was my partner, Will Thomas. Who's your favorite person to dance with now? Oh, oh, my friend Eleanor Scott. I love her dearly. She's a choreographer on Broadway right now, and she's my favorite. What's your all-time favorite routine? Of life? Yeah. Oh, well, I actually have an answer. Um, Crystal Pike choreographed a piece for Netherlands Dance Theater called The Statement. I saw it back in 2016, and they recently aired it for quarantine to give people entertainment. That's my all-time favorite piece of all time. What's your favorite piece that you've been involved in? Ooh, um, there was a piece that my friend Eleanor Scott had choreographed when she had a company a couple of years ago called The Wheel. And it was a piece about the butterfly effect and how the decisions we make can alter the outcomes of our lives. So mm -hmm. it was a really interesting, thought provoking piece that we got to go and play with time. I Ooh. got shot and then like would come back to life and then the person would change their decision and then I like wouldn't get shot or it was, it was trippy. That was my all time favorite piece to be in. Wow, that sounds amazing. Favorite choreography, favorite routine on the show? Ooh, um, favorite routine on the show was the piece that Sonia Taya and, um, oh gosh, I forget. Oh, I'm going to feel so embarrassed when I can't remember his name, but they came and they choreographed for the finale season or for the finale episode. And it was the top 20 for the finale. And it was the blue and the wind. It was like, I forget what it was called, but that was my favorite piece ever on the show. So fun. What's your favorite show experience? Ooh, um, show experience. I think I would have to put that, group those two together. Um, performing that piece in the finale with everybody back after being away for so long, that was my favorite experience. It felt so powerful, but also joyful because we had all gotten the opportunity to come back and be with each other and just really revel in the moment of being back on the show. Yeah. Favorite style that's not your own? Ooh, uh, hip hop. Hip hop is my favorite style that's not me. <laughs> oh, I wish I had like a really good final question. Um, you kind of, oh, you already answered that one. Um, let me think of one on the fly. Go for it. Um, what was the last time that you saw, what was the last routine or piece of artwork past dance that stood out to you that was like, whoa? Mm, that's a really good one. Okay. I would say before um, the quarantine started, I was lucky enough to go see Hades Town. And that entire show was one of the best pieces of artwork that I have ever seen from the music to the singers and the performers to the dancers and the ensemble, the costuming, set design, lighting, every single bit was perfect everything was perfect. And the show itself was so compelling and funny and poignant. I cried, I laughed, I cried, it was better than Cats. Like it was above and beyond the best show I have ever seen. So I am hard pressed to see something that will top it. Amazing. I mean, Ali, thank you so much for taking the time. I've really, really enjoyed talking to you. Well, thank you so much. This is great. Thank you. I'll send you all that stuff and have a great night, okay? Thank you, you too. Yeah. See ya. See ya. Bye.